President Trump delivered two defining, unifying, and patriotic speeches, which drew widespread praise by those who cherish our values, honor our history, and seek to advance policies that lift up all Americans. The President outlined a vision for the future. The President outlined a vision for stronger and safer communities. President Trump said, after all, what do we want? We want a strong military, great education, housing, low taxes, law, and order. He went on to say, we want safety, we want equal justice, we want religious liberty, we want faith and family, and living in the great communities and happy communities and safe communities. And we want great jobs, and we want to be respected by the rest of the world, not taken advantage of by the rest of the world. He went on to say, we should all want the same thing. How can it be any different than those things? This message is now more important and more timely than ever. Radical left-wing mobs seek to tear down our monuments and our memorials. Everyone from George Washington to Abraham Lincoln to Frederick Douglass and even Gandhi. Misguided movements such as defund the police seek to leave our communities more vulnerable than ever. Case in point, this weekend alone. In New York, there were 44 shootings with 11 killed. In Chicago, 75 people were shot with 13 killed. And tragically, at least five of these individuals were children who were killed in cities across the country, an absolutely devastating loss, and we grieve for those families. Crime such as this is dark and it is divisive. This July 4th, the president said, our movement is based on lifting all citizens to reach their fullest God-given potential. Never forget, we are one family and one nation. We will teach our children to cherish and adore their country so they can build its future. This vision is not a culture war as the media seeks to falsely proclaim. It's an embrace of our American family, our values, our freedom, and our future.